really are. <laughs> Good morning. Today is May 8th, 2023. It's like 8.30 in the morning. Just got out the shower. Y'all see these edges are late, okay? Period. But I'm in a great mood today. So I'm in a good mood. You're in a good mood. We're gonna have a blessed day, period. Block out all negativity. Cause we don't got room for that. So I'm gonna get dressed, come back, show y'all that, and take y'all on a day with me to work. I am dressed for work. It's like 9.05. Garm out is at 9 o'clock. However, we own like the fourth month of deployment. So, I'm gonna get there when I get there. All right. Well, here we are. First. So, good morning. Is it good? Yeah. Delicious. Hello. These are jokers right here, mm -hmm. and these are spades. Okay. These are clovers. What am I doing? Yeah. Made it to the. Oh yeah, guys, this is my TikTok famous friend. Trying to go viral. <laughs> Have me some baked chicken, some fried rice, some broccoli, and some baked beans. It don't look that good, but it's <laughs> smacking. It should be, it should be one to ten. Huh? One to ten. How good is Kuwait food? You were rated. Defect. You were rated like five. What would I you rate it? <laughs> <laughs> oh no! We going to a talent show. We going to a talent show. We going to a talent show. You got talent? You got talent? I don't really got no talent like that, child. I can't sing. Y'all hear his voice raspy. I can't sing. I can't play the guitar. It's just not giving. But we finna go support and see who got talent. And I'm gonna let y'all know who I feel like got talent. And if you can't sing, don't you get up there embarrassing yourself. Okay. Baby, get the one to fit. Meditation isn't hard. I think you should learn it. Some lessons they come slow, while others come fast quick. It's like looking at a haystack where no man has found a needle. The other ones are set of blazing in another prequel. Past mistakes can't erase, but they will always lead you to the shade or to your grave. Crazy and I'm out of my mind. Cause all of me loves all of you. Love your Oh, this is my element. I'm starting to feel like I'm in Florida a little bit, but I'm not. But this is so beautiful. I love the water. So this right up alley. Say hey, Dagna. What's up? Oh, <laughs> thank God as hell. Oh, thank God. Say y'all hungry. Y'all are starving. <laughs> I mean, fell off the jet ski, y'all. Y'all, it, it was fun. <laughs> it was water in my ears. It was a little saucy, but hey, it was good. It was a good experience. How was your experience? 10 out of 10. We'll record. Yeah. Yeah. Thank <laughs> you. 
Spicy chicken from the restaurant on this. And I also got some spring rolls. I'm about to eat my food and just chill for the day. It's very important to spend time by yourself. I feel like I'm the most at peace when I'm just literally by myself. I love to be around people, you know. But spend some time with yourself, love on yourself, do stuff that you truly enjoy. And I promise, like, those little days where you take, where you're just by yourself, you can start to appreciate them the older you get, I promise. Well, first yeah. of all, good morning. Good morning. How you too? <laughs> we got a sausage burrito, mm -hmm. potatoes, eggs, and cheese, no bacon, no hot because I don't eat pork no more. Man, you got Oh! <laughs> yeah. First of all, I'm throwing shade, but all right, go ahead. We got some orange juice with a oh. coffee. And then I got mixed berry smoothie coming. Mm -hmm. That's just fat. Y'all, yeah. <laughs> he said he's too good for the defects, so we're eating a six pot. Cheers. Hey, y'all, so we're going to a combat dine out. This is the before. We're about to cut it up. I'm going to be cute. People are going to move with my mess, but I'm going to be cute. And I'm going to come back and show y'all the finished product, okay? So we got the paint and we got the shirt. I'm going to come back and show y'all what we what we come up with. I'm not artistic or creative, so we don't know. We don't see yes, no, I'm not, but we're gonna see. time coming for real like oh my gosh if i think about the first time i went to work all the way till now time really do fly i'm gonna miss my little ocs <laughs> but yeah i'm gonna say bye to everybody today it's gonna be so bittersweet because it's just like you get here you blink and then you leave it like that's a great thing so yes today's my last day last day Hey. Hello. <laughs> so, how was your experience in Kuwait? Terrible. Why? Well, you know, <laughs> I guess. Okay. Oh my God. <laughs> the food is nasty. Yeah. Okay. Uh, vehicles we drive smell like shit. <laughs> yeah, so, your yeah. experience was what? Overall, what? <laughs> okay, what's one good thing about Kuwait? Uh, the mall. The mall. Nice. You bought some stuff? Yeah, I bought a lot of stuff. Okay, blow a bag. Yeah, All right, I got you got the money it. like that. You know? So y'all know who to who who to get at if y'all. Hundred percent. Wait, you a paymaster? Huh? You a paymaster? Yep. So Bye. What? <laughs> hey. Hello. So how was your experience in Kuwait? My experience in Kuwait was great. I met some really good people uh, that I can hang out with outside of work and doing work. Uh, like, help me in my personal life. Mm -hmm. Help me uh, be able to talk to people better. 
He helped me uh my spiritual life as well. Ooh. Met some uh some people that helped me develop my relationship with God and those kind of, kind of things are priceless. So. Mm -hmm. so what's your favorite thing about Kuwait? My favorite thing about Kuwait was the people because it made the whole like experience go by. Who was your favorite person out here in Kuwait? My favorite person was uh, Moses. <laughs> Moses. Okay. And what's your least favorite thing about Kuwait? My least favorite thing? Yeah. The heat? Yeah, the heat. It was it, it was tolerable, but it was a little bit. You know what I'm saying? It's a little crazy. It was a little crazy. Yeah. So. <laughs> to ten. Yeah. In my experience. Yes. Ten. Oh, a ten. It was something I never experienced before. Mm -hmm. And uh, I wouldn't say I would do it again, but I wouldn't mind. But you wouldn't do it, it was, again, but you wouldn't mind. It was a great first experience. So would you come back to Kuwait? Yes. All right. Thanks for the interview. gym or if you just want to come here relax a lot of people be in here and knocked out on these massage chairs these are the truth like i don't be want to leave <laughs> but it's so peaceful in here and i love it okay y'all so here is our showers we have way more but these are just the ones that i currently use they have hooks so you can put like your bags and stuff but for the most part, these showers are really, really clean. They come like twice a week to clean them. Or maybe, I think it's like every two days or so. But yeah, they're clean. important for a girl to know how to do like her hair her makeup just in case nobody's around like deployment well I, somebody can do my hair but i'm tired of the braids the braids gotta go so i'm gonna hook myself up and i'm gonna come back and show y'all what i look like boom just like that my hair is done this didn't even take long maybe like 30 minutes but um them braids had to go they was cute but y'all know once y'all get not loose after a while them things be looking a mess so hair is done almost home I don't know I'm so excited so excited I'm so excited but yeah hair is done I feel better this is our last workout together yes ma'am how do you feel you feel what it is it is what it is huh it is what it is yeah I mean it's the last one but I'm gonna see you took again y'all he is not gonna come to Vada no I did lie to you if he come back to Vada Star, I owe y'all hundred dollars, okay? Cool. Dang. <laughs> ah! Hi. Hi. I'm just How trying to. You? I know. I was telling you guys bye. Okay, I... Yes. I, I don't know about coming back, but. You will come back. No, 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 no. You I'm not like... coming back. Hey. You don't like. You don't like quit? No, it's too hot. No, Make me want to pass out. Hi. You, you come now, man. Now, man. No, 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 no. Next time you come now. Oh, I'm not coming back. Why? We like you. I know. Yeah. so I can give you guys my review on Kuwait. Um, a lot of people say Kuwait is not a deployment. However, I believe 
if you're away from your family, your friends, your norm, your bed, all of that, you know, you're sacrificing your time. Whether you feel like it's a deployment or not, it's a deployment. Even though there are a lot of amenities on that base, I can't consider that, like, you know, a regular duty station or whatever. But however, they say it's a deployment, so it's a deployment. It is what it is. Um, in Kuwait, you get tax-free, so your paychecks are tax-free, so you get paid roughly, maybe, on my situation, I can only speak for myself, I got paid maybe like $300 more, um, and then, like I said, I don't have any, I didn't have no bills while I was on deployment, so I was really able to save a lot of money, so I'm very grateful for that. Overall, my experience in Kuwait was great. I met so many people, I grew my relationship with God. I just really took time for myself on that deployment on this deployment and i'm so grateful for it um it is what you make it though it is really hot however y'all if you go during january like january march april may no january february march um it is cold so please don't let nobody tell you that kuwait is just strictly hot no it definitely gets really cold and um it was windy and then it was a time period where it was just raining every day and then it gets really freaking hot so if you go during like january to like april and then you're there for the summer as well you're gonna need to pack winter clothes and summer clothes so don't let nobody tell you it don't get cold in kuwait because it definitely does however it definitely does get really really hot i think that was maybe my number one thing that i didn't like about kuwait and i was there during a good time so i we left just as the heat was kicking off and it was already too hot y'all it's like you cannot in Kuwait you can't do nothing during the day when it's summertime it's that hot y'all it will literally take your breath away you're like I'm not even playing it's spicy out there it's a good experience for me like everything when I first got out there I'm like dang everybody was like dang the defect is busting this food is so good we got to like the third month of deployment and that defect food was not hitting no more. Like it would make us sick. It just make us feel bad. So like the third and fourth month, really the fifth month, y'all, everybody just stopped eating that defect or be eliminated because people were getting sick. So that's all I got to say. I don't know if it'll become better or not, but when you first get out there, you're going to be like, this defect food, good. But I think that's with everything. Like if you keep eating it every, every day, you're going to get tired of it. So that was another thing that I did not like. Like the defect food started to get real nasty, but there's so many other food options on base that you can go to purchase food. But if you're just trying to save your little money, make you a little sandwich at the defect or whatever. Midnight chow to me is the best meal. Um, I always used to get like the omelet and stuff like that. So that's an alternative. But however, my favorite thing about Kuwait were the people. Um, you're gonna meet great people. Um, don't be afraid to get out, volunteer for stuff. I was the vice president of the Defenders Association. So I met a lot of people. I also got coined. Yay! I got coined. Um, I did a lot of volunteer work. So I just advise y'all, on deployment, do not slack off. That's the time where you want to get out, volunteer for stuff, make friends. There's so much to do on base to the point where it's like on your off day, once you know you get adjusted and stuff on your off day, you'll have a lot to do. So yeah, that was my experience on Kuwait. I enjoyed my time, but it was definitely time to go, but it wasn't bad at all for me, so.